ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಸಹೋದಿತ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೆ ರಾಧಿಕ ಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಶಾಕಲ್ಪತರು ವಶ್ಯಕಿ ಪಾಸಿಂದು ಬಿಭಜ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೆ ಭವೈಷ್ಣವೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮ ಮುಖಂ ಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂ ಪಂಗುಂ ಲಂಘಿರಿ ಯತ್ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ವಂದಿ ಪರಮಾನಂದ ಮಾಧವ ಬೃಂದಾವಿ ತುಳಸಿ ದೇವೈ ಪಿಯಾವಿ ಕೇಶವಶ ಕೃಷ್ಣಭಕ್ತಿ ಪದ ದೇವಿ ಸ್ವತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ್ವ ನರಂಚೈವ ನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪಾತ್ರಶ ಪ್ರಕಾಶ ನೇಚ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರು ಭಕ್ತಿ ಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದೇಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನವಿಷ್ಟೂಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವಿರಿಂಚಿನುತ ಶರಣ ಭೀತ್ತಿಹಂ ಪುನೋತಪಾಲ್ಲಭವಾಪೋತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷ ತೇ ಚರುಣಾರಭಿಂದ ಯತ್ಪಾದಲ್ಲವನ ಕಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿಗೋಧ್ಯೂಷ್ವಾದರ್ಶಿ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗರ ಸುಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾಶಿ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭುನೀತ್ಥಾನ ಶ್ರೀ ಅದ್ವೈತ ಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವಾಸಿ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭುನೇತ್ಥಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀ ಅದ್ವೈತ ಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವಾಸಿ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಅಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನುಕಾ ಬದಾತು ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈ ಕಪಿತರು ಕಮಲಾಯುತಾಕ್ಷ ಭೀಷಾಂಬರೋ ದ್ವಿಜವರೋ ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲೋ ಪಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರಿ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿತೋ ದೀಪರೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಿ ನಿತ್ಯ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ ಸದನ್ನರನ್ನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯ ಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭುಷೀ ತ್ವಾಮಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಮನೋಂಗಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವರಾನುಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶನಾಥ ವಾಗೀಶಜಸ್ವ ಭದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಸ್ ಚ ಭಕ್ಷಿ ಯಸ್ತಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಬಿ ತ್ವಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರಿ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 
ಕಾಯೇನು ವಾಚ ಮನಸೇಂದಿಯೋರ್ವ ಬುಧ್ವಾತ್ಮನಾಭ ಅನುಸಿತ ಸ್ವಭಾವ ಕರೋತಿ ಜದ್ ಜದ್ ಸಕಲಂ ಪರಸ್ಮೈ ನಾರಾಯಣೇತಿ ಸಮರ್ಪಯೇತ್ ಕಾಯೇನು ವಾಚ ಮನಸೇಂದಿಯೋರ್ವ ಬುಧ್ವಾತ್ಮನಾಭ ಅನುಸಿತ ಸ್ವಭಾವ ಕರೋತಿ ಜದ್ ಜದ್ ಸಕಲಂ ಪರಸ್ಮೈ ನಾರಾಯಣಾಯು ಸಮರ್ಪಯೇತ ಗೌಡಿಯ ಗೋಷ್ಠಿಪತಿ ಶ್ರೀಶಿಲ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಸಿದ್ಧಾಂತ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ಗೋಸ್ವಾಮಿ ಜಗ ಪ್ರಭುಪಾ ಪರಮಂಶ ಜಗದ್ಗುರು ಟೋಲ್ಡ್ ದಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಅವರ್ ಟಾರ್ಗೆಟ್ ಟು ಕಲೆಕ್ಟ್ ಹ್ಯೂಜ್ ಅಮೌಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಮನಿ ಇನ್ ಅವರ್ ಲೈಫ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಇಫ್ ವಿ ಡೂ ಸೋ ದೆನ್ ಆಟೋಮೆಟ್ ಆಟೋಮೆಟಿಕಲಿ ಡ್ಯೂ ಟು ಮನಿ ಪವರ್ ವಿ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಗ್ರೋ ಫಾಲ್ಸ್ ಇಗೋ we can ignore and insult guru vishnu that kind of adversity we can develop in our life gauri goshti bhakti sisila bhakti siddhanto saraswati goshami jagat prabhupad paramahansa jagat guru said that it is not our target to collect to collect huge amount of money in our devotional life because if we do so then we can grow false ego inside us and we can express adversity to insult guru vishnu pure guru vishnu even i cannot keep any deposit money for you i cannot leave any deposit money for you all because then you can become ideal you can sit and take prasadam and enjoy your life i cannot allow you to lead your life this way i cannot deposit any amount i am not going to deposit any amount to secure your future life on the contrary i can take lend i can lend money from outside to do radha govind gaur or seva and you will have to pay all this debt you will have to pay many so that you cannot take any rest in your life because in devotional life there is no question of any rest i cannot allow you to take rest this kind of situation i i can never create in my life it was the nature of sila pohupad divine nature he never allowed any of his disciple to take rest this is the capacity which a sadguru should have if sadguru is failure to engage disciple in proper seva then he can get lesser time to look at maya and they can fall down so sadguru can surely never can give allow you any time when you can take rest and enjoy your life sadguru can never do it. so all the time it is the nature of sadguru i mean sila prabhupad specially to engage all disciple in different seva all the time even after 7 10 days our haigya brahmachari madhu gosi maharaj coming today is the abhirbhav tithi and tiruvap tithi of sila gaur kishor bahaj maharaj jai sila gaur kishor bahaj maharaj tiruvap tithi ki jai ಜಯ ಸಿಲೆ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಮಾಧು ಕುಸುಮ ಅವಿರ್ಭಾವ ಸ್ಥಿತಿ ಕಿ ಉತ್ಥಾನ ಉತ್ಥಾನ ಎಕಾದಶಿ ತಿಥಿ ಬಾರ ಮಹಾಮಹೋತ್ಸವಕ್ಕೆ ಸೊ ದೀಸ್ ವೇ ಸಿಲೆ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಮಾಧು ಕುಸಿ ಮಾ ಸ್ಪೀಕಿ ವೆನ್ ಐ ಕಮ್ ಬ್ಯಾಕ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಟೆನ್ ಟ್ವೆಲ್ವ್ ಡೇಸ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಔಟ್ ಸೈಡ್ ಆಫ್ಟರ್ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಪ್ರಭುಪಾ ಸ್ಪೀಕಿಂಗ್ ಓ ಯು ಆರ್ ಕಮಿಂಗ್ ಓಕೆ ಯು ಟೇಕ್ ಪ್ರಸಾದ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಈವ್ನಿಂಗ್ ಟೈಮ್ ಯುವರ್ ಟೆನ್ ಇಸ್ ದೇ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಹೌರ್ ಯು ಕು ಗೋ ಇನ್ ಸೇವ even 4 5 6 hours not going to allow them all the time engage everything that is the technique of sadguru we think guru vishnu is merciless why they are going to engage and in so, so much seva we think they are merciless but not that they are so merciful they like they like to ensure that this life we can get the lotus feet of gorang that's why they engage in our self all the time 
some sannyasi coming from outside, one day gone, two day. Then when going to pay pranam, what is your seva at present? Prabhupada, actually what seva you told is over. Now I complete. Now you do, go there. This is seva. Always engage. It is a technique of Sadhguru. Because bonded soul, passive heart, they cannot engage them in seva perfectly. The heart is passive heart. They cannot engage them in seva perfectly. Or sometimes going to engage, but their mind is somewhere else. It is the nature. It is the nature. They cannot, you know, say. This way, Prabhupada used to engage everybody in seva. What we are discussing here, you can also see, Uddhav wanted to go with him there. But Bhagavan said, no, you will have to carry out my order. You will have to carry out my order. Fancifully, we can do some seva. But that is not actually seva. After knowing the heart of Guru Padma, when we can do seva, that is called actual seva. Otherwise, it cannot be called seva. One day, all disciples get together, maybe before Gurfuni, Usually for that time they are coming. Then all disciples all around. And Popat started asking one by one, what seva you like? You, what seva you like? Somebody speaking, this seva I like. Somebody speaking, this seva I like. Or yet another devotee speaking, this seva I like. But when Prabhupada asking Sila Bhakti to Madhu Gusri Maharaj, I mean Hayagur Brahmachari. Hayagur Brahmachari speaking, Prabhupada, whenever whatever seva you are giving to me, whenever whatever seva you give to me, immediately, I feel so enthusiastic energy. I like it very much. Not this seva, that whatever seva you give me, I like it very much. I like to, all the time, I like to do the enthusiastic mood. That is called the mood of a Sadguru. Who like to engage all disciples because bonded soul can do seva themselves. But they have no information about the heart of Guru Patpat. What he like? Follow. Somebody thinking collecting money is a nice seva. Then Gurudev surely will be very happy. But if you search out the heart, Prabhupada like you to do this seva. This way, nobody could realize Prabhupada perfectly. Some of our Guru Varga, they could realize. But all other, they couldn't realize. And we can externally see, somebody can ask, what seva Prabhupada has done for his Gurudev? Somebody can. Because people are with all doubt and suspicion. They have no faith in Guru Vishnu. No faith. They can ask. He was speaking so many things, but what seva Prabhupada has done for Guru Krishna Bhajima? Somebody can say. Somebody can ask, na? then what you can give answer? What you can give answer? What was the seva of Rupa Goswami path for Sanatan Goswami path? What seva? What is the seva of Jiva Goswami path for Rupa Goswami path? Guru, that's not a point. Actually, Sri Chaitanya Manavishtam Sthapitam Jena Bhutale. That is the vital point upon Sadguru. Sri Chaitanya Manavishtam Sthapitam Jena Bhutale what we are speaking by Rupa Goswami path, that is applicable for all our Rupanuga Guru Varga. So externally you cannot find that the Prabhupada is not going to serve Gurudev, not cooking, not washing clothes, nothing. What Seva is doing? But you don't know that Gaur Kishore Babaji Maharaj is so much satisfied with Prabhupada, you cannot imagine. Because they know everything. Gaur Kishore Babaji Maharaj 
from heart understand what seva is doing what a gigantic seva what a enormous seva he is doing for gauranga he has knowledge he is not foolish to to seek the satisfaction of gurudev to do seva accordingly is called actual seva to be frank so gaur kishor bahaji mara surely not going to do any external seva but it is the desire of gaur kishor bahaji mara to spread to preach gauravani all around and what to speak more he himself wanted to do in his whole lifetime though is that's why we say paramahansa acharya varjo otherwise one paramahansa we usually don't see acharya varjo because they are doing exclusive bhajan they are paramahansa uttam vishnu to for, for preaching and teaching we need to come down to second level madhyam adhika paramahansa all around watching vishampurna sukhayate no problem they are not going to teach so it was the desire of gaur kishor bhai maharaj that you can preach gauravani all around that prabhupad used to do whole day and night no resting but people are asking so many thing so many thing they are speaking against bhakti sindh prabhupad even they are even they are speaking that pope are not going to obey the instruction of gaur kishor bhai maharaj gaur kishor bhai maharaj told him my prabhu don't go to the world of kali kali brahman don't make any disciple it is my request and don't do a material association don't do any association not material any association any association to but outside people saying he never wanted to obey like people speaking jibogo singh bad is not at all following rubogo singh bad he wanted to establish sakiyabad and rubogo singh wanted to establish parakiyabad so material people can say whatever they like they can pass any what it concern i am feeling sigh to speak all tatva siddhanto i am feeling sigh all you know about ragavat mein because is very secret i should not speak but what to do some i will have to speak i am feeling uneasy already i complete up to that point what vishwana chakravarti told then i will have to elaborate outside clarify but still i am feeling uneasy this is because if we follow prabhupad we will have to follow prabhupad perfectly not that we follow prabhupad only verbally not that then we cannot get any power because all our bhajan is under the guidance of guru var otherwise no question of any power we cannot get any power in our bhajan guru ki pa hi kevala to gaur kishor bhai maharaj speaking that you don't go to the brahmand of kali and don't make any disciple and don't do any association baba speaking all i obeyed i wanted to obey him in toto no problem what is the siddhant vichar we are in confusion baba speaking i am not going in kali brahmando i am going a prakita prangan of gauri amat vaikuntha prangan popa writing i am going in the aprakito you know natya mandir or courtier you can say of vaikuntha prangan is vaikuntha where i like go to i am going there to uh, to discuss harikatha kirtan do satsanga i am not going in kali and surely you know it for sure i never wanted to make any disciple they are not my disciple they are not my disciple they are all my guru they are not my disciple they are all my guru popa speaking in his final address when everybody complete their speech 
in Avilvab Titi. Everybody appreciate Prabhupada, but Prabhupada shrugging his head, bent down, and after that, everybody's speech is over. Prabhupada speaking as, with folded hand. Today, all my Guru Bharga, they wanted to glorify me. I am not at all qualified. As they are speaking, I am not qualified. Anyway, they are my Guru. They are going to protect me, keeping a close watch on my each and every activity. All my Gurudev, Guru Varga, they are my Guru. They are going to keep a close watch on my activities. I am doing any wrong, my character is bad or good, what I am doing, what I am eating. This is my advantage. People think that Gurudev so much restriction has. But Gurudev, Gurudev like to keep a close watch on your, all your activities to save us. But we think yes, very bad. Why he is going to take so much information? He like to keep a close watch on each and every activity so that he can guide me properly. This life you need not. I promise you, this life you can get Goranga, provided. You can follow Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati. I touch Bhagavad and speak. So much confidence I am. My Guru Mahārāj told. This life, you know, but you can follow him. Is it possible? So restriction. Bhaddhoji never want to be regulated. Bhaddhoji never want to be regulated. They like to preserve some personal desire, this, that. That's why, big problem. That's why, big problem. Prabhupada in his last speech, that's why he told. I was bound to speak all heavy. I was bound to speak so heavy. They misunderstood me. They thought I am their enemy. But I was really bound to put pressure on them, speak heavy, to engage them in Harikatha without any duplicity. That was my fault. That was my fire. I wanted to engage them in Hari Bhajan without any duplicity. That's why I was so strict speaking. People think I'm criticizing. I'm going to speak them heavy. So I'm, I'm merciless. But someday, some life, they can understand. What I wanted to do for them, they can someday, if their luck is good, someday they can realize. So actually, Hari Bhajan is only possible under the guidance of these kind of strict Gurudev who can never indulge me any anything. Now at present, flattering. Popa speaking, serving disciple, serving disciple giving mantra to base suppress. Popa speaking. Popa speaking, right. Right, exactly I can show you. If you can come with me, I can show. They are, they are serving disciple. Disciple not serving Gurudev. Gurudev serving disciple. Giving mobile 35,000, 40,000 or 50,000. Arranging some facility. So Gurudev serving disciple. Disciple not serving Guru. So, Papa speaking, if we are going to take seva from Gauranga, then it is very bad. In the name of Gauranga seva, if we like to, in the name of Gauranga seva, if we like to take seva from Gauranga, what is the utility? That is not good. So this is our condition. So, Prabhupada speaking, I never going to Kali Brahmanda. I am going to Vaikuntha Prangan in Calcutta. There, Gauriyamat, there to speak and hear Harikatha Kirtan. And the kind of the kind of highest association, absolute association, the kind of absolute association I have received from my Guru Padma. I feel no desire, I have no test to do the association of all those people. I have no taste. I am not feeling any taste to get the association of outside people. 
kind of highest association, absolute association I have received from my Guru Padma. How I can feel interest to get association of material people outside? Then you are talking with outside people, they are kind to meet you. You are not doing as no, I am not doing. I am not doing. I am going to give them the association I have received from my Guru Padma. I wanted to pass on to them. Baba speaking. I, I want to give them the association of my Gurudev by my Harikatha. I want to, I want to, I want to deliver them from their fallen condition. You discover that I am discussing with people, but I am not doing association. I am not doing, I am not feeling any interest. I have no taste. My taste is already changed. Sila Bhakti Dhritta Madhu Goswami Maharaj, wherever he used to go for preaching, all outside people coming, he is very nice looking, handsome figure, so nice. By looking Madhu everybody went in. Impossible. He has done such a nice Guru Seva. In India, if you search out, if in India, if you search out all those important spots where he has established temple, you can go. There, one inch land you cannot get. One inch by one inch land you cannot get. But it was possible. Governor of India, these, that, every, you know, everybody, Punjab governor or president, all used to come and bow down. So, all important places, you go and see all important places. So, whenever he is going in any temple, then people, they feel happy, they are coming all. So, in Calcutta Mount, one Marwari people, he is coming daily, old man, retired, one or two times coming in a temple. My morning time, evening time. Whenever he is coming, he discovered, he can see that Paul Madhu Goswami is talking with somebody. Whenever coming, after Arati, morning Arati, after Arati, whenever he, he, he can discover the Maharaj is discussing with somebody. One day, with folded hand, he is asking to Bhakti Madhu Goswami, if you never mind, I like to speak something. For what? Actually, when you are doing your bhajan, why all the time you are talking with people? When you are doing your bhajan, asking to a great acharya, he is asking to Madhugas, when you are doing your bhajan, you know, I discover all the time you are discussing. Madhugas even not become angry. He become very happy. He smile. Wait, wait. Sit. After that speaking, what is your idea about bhajan? What is your idea about bhajan? You think people can say in a very tranquil, I mean, uh, in, a, in a very solitary place, do Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna. This, you think so. But you don't know, this is the main duty given to us. We are doing our personal, naam, job, everything separate. But it is our duty, when bonded soul coming, we are speaking Harikatha. This is also a vital part of our bhajan. This is also a very vital part of our bhajan, our Gurudev told. That's why I am speaking, not material talking, speaking Harikatha. We are speaking Harikatha. So this is our topmost bhajan. If somebody thinking, try to understand very secret Siddhant, if somebody is thinking that preaching and bhajan not same, if somebody is thinking preaching and bhajan is not same, then he is a fallen soul. He don't understand. When in your life preaching and bhajan become same significant, then you are a great devotee. Otherwise, you are not. Preaching and preaching and your bhajan all same significant. I mean, preaching is also your 
main bhajan. Long ago, when Bhaman Goswami went to North 24 Pargana in Bengal, here some place. After that, very old, very poor people. He used to go to all poor, money to all pure people, Assamese people. Even cannot give you 50 paisa. So poor, the tribe also. He used to go there. He used to go there. Such a devotee at present very rare. No room. One room is there, all leakage. Tin, tin, you know, tin room. All leakage. When rain coming, whole night, Mara sitting with umbrella. Not sleeping. But still have patience to deliver them. Very poor man. Even they cannot provide one room. That room is all leakage all around. All leakage all around. When Toronsel, Assamese, uh, rain is there, Meghalaya, Assam, Assam, their rain is very much. So rain coming, Maharaj with umbrella sitting and doing Harinam. Still wanted. This was the case with Parma Madhav Goswami Maharaj. Even poor people, they cannot provide a tin room, mud room, tin, nothing. You will have to say outside. And whereas all jungle, all jackal, shank come, come. Only a bamboo structure there, like in a train, first, you know, second bunker, third bunker. Bamboo, bamboo, with bamboo. First bunker, second bunker. Madhu Goswami is sitting there, and Bhakti Bala is sitting in the next bunker. Night time, Tithu Goswami is speaking. Night time, I can clearly hear the sound of snack going on. But still, Gurudev is there. This way they started. Now, preaching is one kind of luxurious thing. You think I am speaking lie. You have no idea. You think I am speaking something superfluous. Not that. If you hear their preaching life, you can shed tears. How possible a man? No drinking water from long distance. They are bringing water. But still, they wanted to deliver all poor people. Assamese people, very poor. Who can go to deliver them? Punjab. There, people are Mayavadi, most of the people. It was only Madhu Goswami he wanted to preach this Gauranga Mahaprabhu. Before, nobody went there. Nobody went there. Only Madhu Goswami went. Punjab all Mayavadi went. They don't like to hear anything. But the so powerful Madhu Goswami, he went there to preach Bhakti. In a day, four time, Harikatha. I am doing nothing. What I am doing? They used to speak Harikatha four times. Morning time, after, after, after that, noon time, afternoon time, night time, four time. And not only that, but also, Madhu Goswami used to invite all Guru, our Guru, I mean God brothers, you come. By your darshan, people can feel pure. My Guru Maharaj was very innocent. He never can ask anything from anybody, cannot speak loudly. Always, whole life. I mean, in one sense, he cannot come down to second level. It is the man. But still preaching was done. Only by looking at him, by his activity, hearing some kirtan and harikata little. But still Madhu Goswami used to, you come with me. Jajabra Goswami Maharaj, Madhu Goswami Maharaj, our Guru Maharaj, sometimes Siddhar Maharaj, whole day speaking Harikat, no time. Siddhar Maharaj in home, in home, I mean at a room inside, to speak all the day. Even after Arati, a bird are chipping, you can hear. Sun going to rise and started closing eyes and speaking Harikat. This way, 
our Guru Bhargava, I mean, Guru Bhargava, they are so, so they are not 24 Pagana, some of his disciple who is a Sevak, he is speaking, Maharaj, we cannot come here again. Why, why, why? They are, we are not getting any pranami at the same time. No man can give energy for them. Maharaj speaking, our, that disciple speaking, it is the wastage of our bhajan. This kind of rumor. The disciple speaking, oh, Maharaj, only wastage of bhajan. Our Maharaj speaking, Maman Goswami Maharaj, what do you mean by bhajan? When our preaching and bhajan same significant, then we are doing. When your preaching is for collecting money only and to cheat people, then you are falling. No father can save you. No father, even your Gurudev is Siddha Mahatma, he cannot save you. Because he is also dissatisfied with you. Then that case. So this way, people used to insult our Prabhupada. Prabhupada, they, outside people, they used to insult Prabhupada by watching. Why are your Gurudev saying? Why are your Gurudev saying? What is his qualification? They say, wanted to insult. Prabhupada. Prabhupada speaking very, very smartly. Well, the permanent address of my Guru Padma, Paramang Sacha Jyoti, unto the lotus feet of Simati Radharani. That is permanent address. But at present, you can find even Kulia at the bank of Ganga. People think he has no educational qualification. That is also one kind of evolution. The topmost Pandit in the world, topmost Pandit in the world, going to accept such a guru who is having no educational qualification. That is one kind of evolution. That you should think, how possible? How possible? This is one kind of evolution. To make us understand, you try to realize what is called faith in guru, who is guru, how you can accept guru, you should realize all these things. Prabhupada was over sanguine about the authenticity of Gaurakishar Bhai. He knew. Because our Bhakti Mantra told, you can accept this Maharaj. Bhakti Mantra never told, come, come, I can give mantra. He give Harina, okay. You can accept this Guru. Accept this. This is that. So after cheating 17 times, at the 18th time, he was successful to get Diksha. So, Baba speaking externally, Baba speaking externally, you can discover he has no educational qualification. Externally, you can find he has no educational qualification. But be sure, all Shastra, I mean, Ved, Vedanta, Bhagavatam, Upanishad, all the gist. All the gist was there inside his heart, right? 100% right. Externally you can find, my Guru Padma is not qualified. But be sure, all the gist of all, Ved, Vedanta, the cream, after starting, that cream was there inside his heart. So you have no right to insult my Guru Padma that he has no education. What you can do? With money power. You show me? You show me? By money power, somebody going to get Bhagavan. By money power, by manpower, by education, but you show me. On the contrary, I can prove most of the people, I mean devotees, Paravangsa, those are not educational qualification. And they are going to get Bhagavan. So what is your decision? What is your decision? You see? Why Bangshidas Bhavaji is not education? Jagannath Das Bhavaji is not education. Bhagavan Das Bhavaji, no. Eh? Siddha Madhusan Bhavaji, no education. Krishna Das Bhavaji, no education. But stay, they are so highly educated that I have nothing to speak. My conception is dirty conception. Before approaching Siddha Guru Vaishnava, 
we should throw all our past experience. Because whatever we are going to pass remark, thinking, on the background of our past experience bank. Whenever somebody is speaking something, you are looking something, you are going to think everything on the background of your past experience bank. You look up, oh, oh, it must be like this. But all your assumption, estimation, all wrong. So, it is my request, if you have any such qualification before, you can throw everything, because otherwise you cannot understand me. Many people think me enemy. Many thinking, they think I am enemy. I am their enemy. They think me. I don't know. I am not enemy. I am their close friend. I am such a friend, I like to give my life for them. If they can test me. But they are not ready to accept it. Anyway, this is also my luck, bad luck. What to sue? So you see, the reason for why the reason for why our Bhagavan Sri Krishna wanted to leave one representative like Uddham, who is, whose heart is just matching with him. Uddham, his heart is just matching with Krishna. That's why he wanted to. Say, so think Krishna was over sanguine. Krishna could search out some other Pandit. So many in Jadav Bangsa, in Jadav Bangsa, Jadav, Jodhu destiny, destiny, there were so many people. Why Krishna going to wanted to choose them? And there were so many Rishi, Muni, so many things. But why not? Not. It's very important thing. And Sukhdev Goswami is Paramahansa. Sukhdev Goswami can preach, but he is Paramahansa. He is preaching done by Bhagavatam. Specially, all outside people cannot come because he is Paramahansa. All is saying, no clothes, nothing, all here, all around, no bath, all. So, preaching means you will have to become a gentleman. Because Prabhupada used to wear coat and everything, very smart. This is the nature. I can stay with coping in my room. That is my personal. But in front of you, I cannot come this way. Because I have to follow Prabhupada. I have to follow. Somebody giving me costly clothes, I can wear. I can show I am you know, wearing this. Mental attachment should not be there. But I cannot say. This is not good. So, this way, Popad wanted to engage Uddhavji Maharaj. So, Uddhavji Maharaj already having knowledge, vast knowledge. But still, he wanted to get some special, very special knowledge from Krishna before leaving this material world. That's why we are, you know, discussing here. Really so. No sadheti mam jogo, no sankyam dharma uddhava, no sadhaya stapas tehago yatha bhakti mam. You cannot show somebody without bhakti is successful by tapas sadhis. They will have to take shelter of bhakti to get some result, to some extent. Yogi, gani, they are getting some result of their bhajan by the backing of Bhakti Devi, no Bhakti Devi, no touch, means they are failing. They cannot take. So, Bhagavan speaking, Uddham, this kind of different kind of bhajan mode cannot satisfy me completely. It's not possible. And after that, Bhagavan going to confirm Bhakta Aham Ekaya Grahyam. Grahyam. Bhaktya Aham Ekaya Grahyam. Sraddhaya Atma Priyaha Satam. <coughs> Only by the help of Bhakti Devi, I mean, if somebody having Bhaktya, Bhakta Mane, it is third casting by Bhakti. Bhaktya. Hello. Only by Bhakti, I can feel satisfied. Because Bhakti also have some definition, but surely I think Bhagavan going to 
going to mean Bhagavan went to mean Annavila Sunna Bhakti. We cannot say Bhagavan speaking this way, Bhaktam Ekra Gaya. Surely those who are having Annabila's contamination. Grahya mean they can realize me. Grahya. Grahya mean? Grahya mean? Like Kunti Devi told. Janmai Shajya Suto Sivir Re Domano Madaha Pumano Noiva Arhati Abhidatumi Tama Kinchara Gocharam. Gocharam mean? Gocharam mean? Gocharam actually literal meaning is they can see Bhagavan. But here Kunti Devi surely never wanted to mean. Gocharam mean they can realize Bhagavan from heart, they can realize all your tattva, all secrecy, everything. I mean it is also right. They can see Bhagavan. It is called Tattik Darshan. Darshan two type. One is Gorangwapu there, some market man, oh very nice, tall figure, Brahman. Somebody can say, Oh, so nice, tall figure, Brahman. That is not darshan. So many people, when Bhagavan appear and doing this kind of Himalila, surely even the beggar, birds and bees, they also see, oh, there is a man. But that is not actually darshan. That is not actually darshan. Chapal Gopal also used to see Mahaprabhu. Chapal Gopal. But that was his darshan, do you think? Otherwise, why that rascal wanted to insult Sivas Pandit by putting uh, one pot of uh, wine and red china rose and, and vermilion, everything, why? Which all other items of Kali Puja, Tama Puja, he wanted to insult, whereas Sivas Pandit is great devotee. Sivas is the heart of Gauranga Mahaprabhu, heart of Krishna. So, that was not his darshan. That was not darshan. He could see. Hey, going, very tall figure, going to Ganga, this, that. But that is not a marketplace, so many people. Mapu going to buy sabji, this, that. They are watching Mapu. But that is not darshan. When darshan is backed by your tattik darshan, when your all tatta going to give you some backing, you look. Many people coming to Sadguru. They cannot see Guru. What to speak about taking mantra from Guru? Even they cannot see Sadhguru. <laughs> they become angry when I say, What to speak about? I have taken mantra from him. Ach, really? But I think you have not seen. Eh? What do you say? Same thing happened with Prabhupada. One professor used to come to Bhakti Vinayak very often. One day, Bhakti Vinayak inside. He is speaking, Bhakti Thakur, your father he used to love me very much. He loved me very much. Very often he would, I come here, he requests me to read Gita. I recite Gita and he is hearing. He is speaking. Prabhupada become very upset because that professor is false ego. Bhakti, Prabhupada speaking, you have not seen Bhakti Thakur. What? Very often I come here, you don't know. Very often I come here, I recite Gita, this, that, he discuss with me so many things. Again, Papa speaking, I think you have not seen Bhakti Nira. Three times when speak, become very angry. You are a gentleman. Eh? You are speaking, I am repeatedly speaking. I talk with Bhakti Nira, come to Bhakti Nira, he give me some prasadam, I discuss so many things, important things. But you think, you, when he gone, become angry and gone. He become angry and gone. Then Pope was speaking, he misunderstand me. He don't realize what he mean to say. Bhaktivinoda Tagur is not a man, not a man made up of blood and flesh and stool and urine. <laughs> but they think so. Similar thing happened when the first you know, Gauriya mission started in Ultaranga, Calcutta. Calcutta. There, Janmashtami, but there is rented room. What to do? No temple, nothing. No temple, nothing. Within very short period, rapidly our temple developed. But there was no temple. Bhakti Vinod Asan. There, John Mastami, so many disciples of Prabhupada coming, or uh, 
distinguished, distinguished guests, they are also coming. They are going to honor Prasadam in Janmashtami next day. I mean Nanda Usab. Nanda Usab, one educated man, he think himself as a very, you know, uh, Kipa Patra Appapad. He think himself. After that, he is sitting all in queue, line, and you know, took Prasadam in line. And whenever prasadam, and they are giving prasadam, that time one exalted devotee uh, wanted to speak one word to that man, to that man who is feeling false ego. That Prabhupada loved me very much. I am educated. He is speaking, Prabhu, you are taking cake and... Huh? Malpo, Malpo, Malpo and cake. You are eating Malpo and cake, you know, pita, or Malpo pita going to eat you. Understand? You are going to eat Malpo pipa. Malpo, Malpo, Malpo I mean one kind of preparation, very tasty. You are going to uh, eat Malpo pita, or Malpo pita going to eat you. He become very angry. He throw prasadam and gone. What? I never took this Malpa Pita. What do you mean? He become angry. The message, Prabhupada only got mad. Prabhupada laughing. He could not understand the real meaning. I mean, we are taking prasadam. We cannot enjoy prasadam. This means, we can take prasadam with full honor. If prasadam is salt and only rice, many times in my life happened. I come from Vindavan, long distance, two days, no sleeping, because somehow I am coming, no reservation, nothing, somehow. When I come more, there is nothing, prasadam. Only night time, nine o'clock. I say, you have something? I am asking the polite one. Only rice is, okay, you can give me. I take some salt, take prasadam. Many times it happened. I went to Nishingapalli, come back, all prasadam finished. I say, you have something? Well, only some. Rice, you can keep salt. Many times he comes. I go to, from when I come here, I go to Vrindavan, go, Guru Purnima Tithi, I like to do Parikram. I go to the, I'm, where I used to do Bhajan, that small temple. I go there, I take bath and ask, you have some? But nothing there, all finished. Only some dry rice. I can give me dry rice and salt, take and go for Parikram. Bhagavat here. You don't know. Only some rice and salt. I take and go. For, I cannot waste time. I reach 2 o'clock. I reach 2 o'clock and I start Parikam that day. Only next year also. Next year, not this year also. When I went, you can ask Rogu. I go throw my bag and baggages, take bath and start Parikam. If you don't believe, you can ask Rogu. Rogu is there. The day I go, and not for me, I do parikram for Tarun. I do parikram for one crippled man. I do parikram for one, so many, his economical position all fall down. He's crying. This way, we are going to give energy for others. But people cannot understand. They think I am a hero. I never want to become a hero. I like to become zero. I never want to become a hero. It is not my target of my life. Harikatha will to speak by what to do, what I heard and speaking. So you see, <coughs> we should have enthusiastic mood to do seva, Bhagavad seva. No motivation, no motivated, you know. So many people I can show. They are doing parikama every day, one year after they the murder and gone. Murder. They are doing parikama. He is thrown out of temple. Where he can go? He can go and take chapati from Pajavasis and do every day. No job, only parikama. After that, when Mott invite, finally he stab somebody, kill and go. So, now question is that, he is doing parikrama for a long time. What is the result of that particular? I am asking to you. I am asking to you. Okay, he has done parikram. But you show me the result of parikram. 
this is the result of parikram that you can feel angry and kill somebody that's mean whatever bhajan you are doing without the approval of suddha guru try to understand this basic point without the approval of suddha guru vishnu whatever you are doing that is not actually bhajan you are not going to get result some example i am giving for material people they don't understand in our daily life we are doing something positive and negative really something positive also do also negative we don't understand unknowingly doing we are doing mane we are proceeding front and due to aparad coming back follow we are proceeding a little bit again coming back i am giving example of one chess game you know chess game a small boys when there is some there is some uh, uh, guti i mean some they are moving here there is some snack and ladder you know in our uh, we are playing you see whenever you are from from 1 2 3 you go to 99 now only one if you get mark then you can enter success but by chance you are going to make mistake i mean your game is wrong you come back again you face the mim you face the mouth of snack and come back to tail tail end this is our condition i give another example suppose there is some competitive exhibition suppose there is some many time in our student life also appeared different kind of competitive exhibition there each question mark is is question bearing one mark and there is condition if you make mistake then you can be given negative mark so suppose you are going to give answer 50 questions right and 50 question wrong then what will the result zero this is our condition we are doing we are hearing a katha taking bath everything we not that we are not doing but we, at the same time we are also making some mistake that who can detect who can show you this way mistake that's why come now so every day some plus minus going every day we are doing some bhajan going up again some doing negative come this way negative positive negative positive. when we can reach the target this is our condition that is the main thing so bhagwan going to appreciate only bhakti mark or other mark there is no guarantee countless example i can give from mahabharat ramayan from bhagavatam all half way the fault but in devotional field bhagwan already declared you know already declared eh opis chet sudur achar bhajate mam ananya bhag sadureva samantabha sammag vyavasite hi sa also uh, we heard yesterday about oilo oilo bin pururava crying and speaking no yatu kamah kamanam upabhogena sammati habisha krishna vasmaibo bhuyo ebabi bhard all those things shastriyo conclusion all those shastriyo conclusion going to lead me to some concrete point without realizing if we go on doing bhajan like madman without learning how to do bhajan if you go on doing bhajan whole life hence cannot get any particularly you will have to follow one pure devotee who is in line with bhakti siddhant bhakti vinod thakur bhakti vinod dara if there is some particular some uh, ism then people can cannot get now at present is guruism now at present is guruism guruism no like fascism capitalism you know ism different kind of ism going on hey yes really so ism now we are not harmonized with each other all communism capitalism fascism marxism am ism our guru is him now what if guru is fallen but still they are going to approach all oh, good day this is the condition at present 
they are not going to stand even in neutral platform. What to speak more? Even they have no power to speak that it is right, it is wrong. I am not speaking in bhajan. This is right. This is wrong. Even they cannot speak. They can give silence. Wrong or right, they, they have no power to speak. This is right and this is wrong. This is the condition we are meeting. So, bhakta aham ekaya graya sraddhayatma priyaho satam bhakti punati mannishtha sapakan upi sambhavat. Bhagavan speaking, if somebody take bath in a very, very low family, very low caste, very low caste. Bhagavan speaking, Shapakan Upi Sambhavat. Mani, those who are the eater of dog flesh, dog meat or flesh. Even my bhakti can purify them to such an extent that they can become honorable to, ob to observe, to perform jagya. Shad Upi Sabanayo Kalpati. Shad Upi Sabanayo Kalpati. Follow what I say. They become so pure. Bhagavan speaking. Actually, people taking birth, actually, people taking birth in a low family, why you know? You know why? People taking in a, in a very low caste, low family, because of their previous activities. Karma fall. Because of our, because of our previous karma fall, we are going to take birth. But this karma fall can get vanished. Karma fall can do nothing. Karma fall what can do? Like Krishna giving uh, some, uh, some advice, advice means some suggestion, not advice, Krishna, humble very, to father before Govardhan Puja. Karma na jayate jantu. Eh? Karma na jayate jantu. Karma naiva vipadhati. Shukham, dukcham, bhayam, khemam. Karma naiva vipadhati. All due to, due to karma fall there. Shukham, dukham, bhayam, khemam. All karma fall. So who is Indra? If one jiva is going to do this karma fall, the father of Indra can, cannot cut his luck. Because Bhagavan is going to confirm, because it is sure that Bhagavan is say, staying inside the heart of everybody. Bhagavan sitting inside, that's why Bhagavan is confirming. Bhagavan watching, na? as a Paramatma watching, na? what I am doing. Bhagavan watching inside my heart. Like computer job, whenever you do, every five minutes you like to save. If you forget to push that save button, electricity somehow it can go up. This is the case. So all paid up, like computer. What all we have done in our life, all recorded here. You cannot make fool of Bhagavan, all recorded. Whatever you have done, all everything, you cannot do it anything secretly. Because Bhagavan is there sitting, he is watching everything. You are Jivatma doing so. So, when Bhagavan is going to confirm that according to karma fall, Jivas are getting result, Paramatma giving result, Paramatma watching, according to my activities, can give. Who is Indra? Who is Indra? Similarly, all those who are taking bath in a very low caste. Some example is there in Ramayana. What Muni, I forget. He wanted to say, somebody wanted to ask solution of life. He said, three times you will have to speak Ram Nam. He became angry. Why? He speak three times? Only one time Ram. I forget the name of that Muni. Very important Muni. Anyway, sometime this. So this way, one Rishi boy, I mean the son of Rishi, offering Tulsi without washing in water, giving to Bhagavan. His name is Richak Muni, I think. I think Richak Muni, I forget. Huh. He was given punishment to take 
birth in a very low family. I was giving birth. I think I, if not, if I am not going to make, I think I can remember. Uh, he took birth as Gohak Chandal. I think so. And that that bad bad means the hunter who wanted to stick the penetrate the leg of Krishna. He was Bhrigumuni, yeah? He was Bhrigumuni, yes. He was Bhrigumuni. Bhrigumuni he took. I am sure about it. Anyway, sometime I cannot remember, but I am sure he is Bhrigumuni. First, he wanted to provide one kick on the chest, so he wanted to take. Anyway, so I think so. If you can remember, you remember? I remember he is. Vrigumuni, he took birth. No, nah, oh, Jora, 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 I'm sorry. Jora, bad. Jora, bad. Jora, bad, he wanted to target. That Jora, bad, previous life he was that Rishi, Muni. Jora. Jora, who is going to take the small part of the residue of that iron bar and make one very nice, sharp edge. That Anyway, I can, so, Bhagavan speaking, if anybody taking birth in a very low caste, but still, they can, by the power of bhakti, they can cut all their, you know, the result of their, you know, this way. So, all my, those who are following, they, those who are serving me, are uh, full of devotion, they are very dear to me. They are very dear to me. Or again, Bhagavan speaking, Dharmaha eh? Satta Dayo Peto Vidya Ba Tapasanita Mad Bhakti Apetu Atmanam No Samak Punati. Somebody following some Dharma. Dharma is not always the mean Bhagavad Dharma. Somebody will general Dharma which is not going up to that range, like uh, Gokarnaji is speaking to Father. Dharmam bhajasya satatam tejo loka dharma. Samas dharma, bed dharma, loka dharma, like Gopikas. Even Veda dharma, loka dharma, all they are going to reject. They are going to take risks to do seva. So, Bhagavan speaking, dhar dharma, Shatta dayo peto vidya va tapasanita mad bhakti apetu atmanam na sammak punatihi. Without my bhakti, so many people they are falling to those shatya, dana, dharma, vidya, tapasya. They are, they are doing, they are following some dharma, but still they cannot purify themselves, they cannot purify themselves that way, as is possible by bhakti. Like the case of hunter, bad, Naraji purify immediately, bhakti yoga. You go on doing harinam, do this, check babas, immediately change. So, all other procedure not like bhakti yoga. Bhakti yoga can pure you. Bhagavan speaking after that like one golden bar, one golden bar, if you are going to put into fire, then that all contamination, I mean alloy, they can go out. After that, again you burn, it become bright, so bright. Bhagavan speaking, after some, next sloka I can speak, tomorrow I can discuss about you. So, Bhagavan speaking, Dharmaha, Shatto, Dayo, Peto, Vidyava, Tapasanita, Mad eh, bhaktya apetam atmanam na sammak purati. Complete purification, complete purification, if you demand, if you expect, then only we will have to follow bhakti yoga, no other. No other procedure. No other procedure there. Kaye no vacha manasindhya irva buddha atmanava onusrito sabhava. Karoti jad jad sakalam parasmai narayane ti samar payetat. Vanchakalpaturvasi ke basindhu. Patitanam pavanibhu vashu. 
Vaishnava view. Actually, I was thinking that today is the Avir Bhaktiti of Madhu Kusri Maharaj. I have no scope to speak anything. And Gaur Kusri Tiruva. So I wanted to relate the Katha in such a way that they can, their qualification also can be there. Anyway, 